So we're at halftime of the 1990 Nose Bowl. I'm Mike Neighbors along with Mike Atkins. Mike, we got off to a little slow start in this broadcast. Well, they kind of caught us off guard a little bit. And we missed a couple of plays, but we're back now. We'll have everything covered in the second half. Mike, 43rd Nose Bowl. Got things cleaned up for the officials. Now we're ready to go. 43rd Nose Bowl. Uh, a tense rivalry on both sides of the football. You can see the crowd behind me. Uh, some friendships have been made, but once they hit the field, it's pretty intense. <laughs> love has been lost over the years between the pie lambs and the taps in the traditional nose bowl. The two teams anticipate much of the same in this year's contest and can agree this is no friendly rivalry. No comment. Friendly, friendly, friendly. I doubt that very. But um, we take it very, we take it very seriously, and, and there could be there could be some blood on field on Sunday. The Teps can also look forward to an aggressive contest, and even though it's only flag football. They know toughness will play a key role. Intimidation definitely makes a difference, and uh, we have some pretty big guys and uh, some intimidating guys, and hopefully uh, they'll drop a couple passes, cause it. So with both sides waging war on the field, they can also provide a little pre-game talk. Well, Tab, if you take one, it's okay, but you put them as a group, and it's not so good. Uh, I guess come game time, it's not friendly. It's war. Winner take all. I tell you, Mike, we haven't seen any blood yet, but uh, nevertheless, it is pretty intense out here. But along with that, for both sides of the football, it's a very special moment. Though. It really is. We've been saying all the first half that it's more than just a football game, and it is something special to these guys from both houses. It's a chance for them to come closer together, build friendships, and it, for both fraternities, it might be the closest they get all year. No, we're next to be this series between Tep and Pi Lamb dates back as long as some major college rivalries. And while you've heard the players talk about intensity and intimidation, this annual contest means a lot more. Not only for the pledges who play the game, but for the entire fraternity. This is what it's all about. I mean, no time is our brotherhood come together more than at this time. And on Sunday, it'll be very evident about how much this game means to us. And it's not just a chance to flex some muscle. The game serves as a common bond and an opportunity to strengthen friendships. When somebody scores a touch and everybody's running out on the field congratulating their pledge brothers, and it's it's such a it's a great experience. It just brings everyone together. That someone from the outside can really see how important it is to us. So what exactly is the nose bowl? It's one word, unity, and that's that's what nose bowl is about. And Alpha Mueller. Special time of the year and another half to play. We'll be back after this with all your second half nose bowl action.